Welcome to Ben's Experience. In this video, I will share with you how to find your Hostinger FTP access details. First, you need to log in to your Hostinger account. And from this welcoming page, look for the hosting section and click on this manage button. Next to the hosting plan, you are looking for its uh, login or FTP login details. Now from this left side menu, scroll down to files, click on it and select FTP accounts. Now this is your FTP access details. This is the FTP IP or the host name. This is the, ho the username, the FTP port. This is not crucial or uh, required, the, uh, required to log in to your FTP account or access or to access your FTP. And this is the folder to upload files. This is uh, important because you, if you uh, upload files not in this uh, folder, you will not see them when you try to access your website from your na web navigator. Now, if you remember your FTP password, it's great. If you don't, click on this change FTP password and you have this new uh, window that lets you enter a new password and you can use it with these details. Now, uh, Hostinger recommends these FTP clients, Smart FTP if you click or, and also or FileZilla. Personally, I prefer to use FileZilla. Now, if you click on this little uh, link, you will be automatically uh, arriving at this uh, FileZilla official website. Just click on download FileZilla client, click on this green button and just the free version of FileZilla is enough. Click on download. After completing the download, install this software on your computer. It is fully safe. And I think I have FileZilla on this computer. This is the FileZilla interface. Now what you need to do, just click on this little icon next to the host name and paste it here, just like that. Same thing with the username. And FTP, I don't remember my FTP password, so I think I will change it. But before that, let's try to use my Hostinger account login password. I think it will go. Click on quick connect. Yes, always trust this certificate in future sessions in order to avoid seeing this window pop up and wait a minute and you need to look here to see as you can see login incorrect this means my password was not correct now let's click on change ftp password here fill in your uh, new password two times then click on this change password password changed successfully now let's delete Let's delete this one and paste the one I've just renewed to click on quick connect. And I was uh, logged successfully to my, my Hostinger FTP account. Before I continue this tutorial, I would like to let you know that you can get access to my online course about Hostinger Website Builder today for free. Inside this course, you will learn many things including how to get started with Hostinger Website Builder, how to set up and design your website inside Hostinger Website Builder, also how to create and manage your content, how to optimize your SEO, e-commerce and payments uh, features or settings and also how to integrate and use custom codes inside 
hosting your website builder and also long tutorials like how to build a handyman website a personal training website or just a portfolio website if you want to get access to all of these courses today for free and also my other free online courses inside my university just go to university.benzexperience.com link in the description without any further ado let's continue our tutorial now inside this public html folder is where i need to upload my files now let's wait a second and this is my website files if i need to add something new i need to upload it here too how to upload instead of using the filezilla uh, not easy or hard to find folders simply i open my files finder or let's say that i want to look to upload something from the download folder just drag and move it just like that just make sure to not upload it inside a folder you need to upload it here just release your mouse and as you can see the upload progress is shown here the failure transfers are mentioned in this little uh, window and the successful transfers are added here and this is how to find your hosting your ftp details and also a bonus of how to use filezilla if you still have a question leave it in the comments below and don't forget to give this video a like thank you